What's up, YouTube? I am 140 here. Hey, uh, just gonna do a quick two box uh, recap of Contenders. Uh, wasn't all that great, but had a good time opening it. I haven't opened it yet, and I just wanted to check it out. So, uh, <clears throat> picked up some boxes at the LCS and picked up a monster card also at the S LCS. And uh, have a few cards from uh, recent mail days. Uh, picked up a lot. Uh, Patrick Willis lot and also uh, a couple Alex Smith cards, uh, Alex Smith cards. Uh, but just real quickly, just going to show the autos. Uh, I did get one uh, playoff ticket, Mercedes Lewis uh, playoff ticket, um, but not sure really uh, what else. Um, but uh, just going through the autos uh, real quick. Uh, KJ Wright, Seattle Seahawks. Uh, Buster Scrine, Cleveland Browns, never heard of the dude. Uh, Ahmad Black for the Bucks, definitely not a short print there. Uh, and then Vincent Brown. Uh, Dan Bailey, kicker for the uh, Cowboys. Austin Pettis. Greg Salas. And then also guessing that Hankerson, Leonard Hankerson, is not a short print SP, being that I got two in two boxes. So uh, two Hankersons. Uh, TJ Yates. Ricky Stanzi. And then uh, actually pulled this one, uh, which is uh, actually a really, really nice card. Signs of Greatness, Leroy Kelly. And I think that was actually the highlight of uh, of both boxes. So, so it wasn't uh, it wasn't a great box, but uh, I, like I said, I had a good time opening it, and I uh, just wanted to check it out. So, uh, and then for my PC of little or no significance to anybody except for me, I picked up this Ramsey Spartan uh, Prime uh, Triple Threads Rookie Card Auto uh, Jersey Patch Auto, six of thirty. Uh, a lot of you guys know I PC Ramsey Spartan. Uh, low line fruit for sure. Uh, his cards can be had for the cheap, but he went to my college, uh, Cal Poly, which is a small college, and I just PC him and pick his stuff up when I find some cool stuff. So, uh, um, you know, there it is. So I picked up that. I picked up this very nice Alex Smith uh, prime jersey patch uh, numbering lettering I don't know what that is but it's a uh, three color with four breaks um, from limited 2010 limited nice card and that is 17 of 50 and then I picked this up on a blowout card forum and this is out of uh, what is it Bowman Sterling it's a 101 um, Alex Smith uh, three colored jersey patch with breaks uh, one of one plate uh, I don't know one of one jersey patch card or whatever it is uh, the only bummer thing is is that the seller that I got this and a couple other cards uh, total flake you know just if he if I wouldn't have reminded him on just to ask him where the cards were he never would have sent it like I sent him like just asking where you have you have you sent the cards and he's like oh it went out today and that was like a week and a half after I bought the lot and then he didn't ship one of the cards and it's just kind of a just typical um, guys you know just a flake and so now I'm chasing the uh, refund and it's just kind of a nightmare because he's not communicating but got this card and it's all good so uh, it's a beautiful card got a pretty good price on that and then I bought a uh, Patrick Willis uh, auto lot off of one of the uh, one of the forums it was a while ago but it's just I've been meaning to shoot the mail day so uh, signing day out of SP rookie threads. That's a nice card. Uh, cool one out of press pass. In the old Miss uniform rookie ink out of uh, upper deck. And then chirography out of SP authentic. Uh, out of tops performance breakout non numbered. And then two of these rookie out of top performance rookie autos. And then this uh, out of um, Sweet Spot, nice helmet auto. And this is numbered 43 of 7.99. And then for the Monster card, uh, I've been actually uh, paying. This is on layaway at the LCS, and um, 
my LCS was kind enough to uh, be patient with me because I'd go in there and bust boxes and not pay it down. But then, you know, I go in there so much that they're super cool. But um, Tops 1965, card number 122, PSA graded 5, players Joe Namath. And, uh, thing's pretty beautiful, actually. So graded 5. Uh, I think it's uh, for this card. It's actually a pretty good grade. They actually got in um, when he he had just purchased a huge lot off of a old collector. I think it was a widower or a widow of a of a collector, and uh, he had the entire 65 top set. Um, and Kevin at the local local card shop, they send it in for grading. So he, I, you know, he said, listen. Um, if you want this, I'll I'll grade it and I'll, I'll I'll give you a good price on it, which he did, and then he allowed me to put it on layaway. So um, just finally picked it up today, and um, just really really stoked on the card. Um, it took me a while just to do, just because I you know it was flaky, um, and they were super patient with me, and I picked it up. So really really good looking card. Uh, it's in plastic right now, but you know, probably one of the better cards in my collection. So that's it. Um, really happy about this card, and uh, I hope everybody is doing well. Um, and uh, that's all, man. Peace.